Do you know how to unpivot data in Excel? Let me showcase you. So here you can see we have name, Jan, Feb and March sales data or sales quantity we have. So I want to unpivot this data. What is the meaning of unpivot? Let me showcase you one simple example. So simply we can copy this. Unpivot scenario I'm just showcasing you the what is the format we have. So I'm just to unpivot this. Right now I'm just doing it manually but we can do with the help of formula. That is what I'm showcasing you after this. So let's copy this Rohit and I will paste it here and then we need to showcase the values we can copy and we can transpose this values part also yeah so same as this we have just kept this Rohit same as we have to kept Sushil and for the Mukesh also so this is called as unpivot data how we can do with the formula this unpivot scenario let me showcase you so what we can do we can simply use one formula is equal to first we need to use here h stack function then we can use here one more formula that is to call and then we can use if na so we need to use this scenario if na we need to use open the bracket we can select the value and if value if na we have two syntax value and will value if na so this will be tricky part but we have to do these steps or these formulas we have to use to unpivot the data set so now i'm just selecting this range then comma for value if any we need to select this names right so this is my first part i'm just closing the bracket again use comma now what i will do for now i'm just using enter you can see i'm getting jan fem march jan fem march jan fem march three times automatically but we need to use this to call and if any scenario two more times let me showcase you how we can use that but before that i will wrap this just to showcase you full formula yeah so now the second scenario is what second array is what we need to use again to call to call and if any open bracket and for the value part you can select now uh, you can just change the scenario now i'm just selecting this name first then this heading jan feb march we are just selecting close the bracket close the bracket again use comma and for the third array we can select this data set that we have comma not like this data set but we need to use to call again to call if any again and now we can select data set two times comma again data set close the bracket close the bracket again close the bracket press enter you will get your data in unpivot scenario you can see this is just a tricky part we have but it is very useful when you want to convert your horizontal data in the vertical format this is called as unpivot scenario in excel if you like this video don't forget to share